historic, prestigious, iconic. These are just a few descriptors of the Hasty Pudding Institute of 1770, which is comprised of the Hasty Pudding Club, the Hasty Pudding Theatricals, and the Harvard Crocodillos. The Hasty Pudding Club is the oldest social club in the United States. It boasts a distinguished membership, including five U.S. presidents, William Randolph Hearst, Jack Lemmon, and many other luminaries in entertainment, academia, business, and public service. The club was founded in 1795 when 21 Harvard juniors decided to establish a new and secretive on-campus society to, quote, cultivate the social affections and cherish the feelings of friendship and patriotism. They also mandated that members shall provide a pot of hasty pudding for every meeting, a tradition that continues in a slightly different manner to this day. You need over the last two centuries, the Pudding has grown into a premier performing arts organization, a patron of the arts and comedy, and an advocate for satire and discourse as tools for change worldwide. There is no other organization quite like it in the world. Born from the Hasty Pudding Club, the Hasty Pudding Theatricals performed its first musical on Friday the 13th, December 1844. The Theatricals has grown into an original, student-written and composed, full-scale, pun-filled musical extravaganza, which culminates each year in an all-male kick line. All told, 50 students work together in the cast, band, tech crew, and business staff to stage a 35-show run in Cambridge, Massachusetts, with additional performances in New York City and Bermuda. The Pudding Show is known for its long tradition of daring social and political commentary. Me a witch? Well, that's about as likely as universal health care. Oh, please! <laughs> Every year, the Hasty Pudding Theatricals bestows the Man of the Year and Woman of the Year awards on performers who have made lasting and impressive contributions to the world of entertainment. The Woman of the Year award dates back to 1951, when Gertrude Lawrence received her pudding pot. Since then, recipients have included Elizabeth Taylor, Lucille Ball, Meryl Streep, Sandra Bullock, and Anne Hathaway. The Man of the Year Awards began in 1967 with Bob Hope. Subsequent recipients included Sean Connery, Tom Hanks, Robert De Niro, Bill Murray, Robert Downey Jr., Justin Timberlake, and James Franco. The awards attract considerable press attention worldwide. The event is regularly covered by broadcast news organizations and featured on major entertainment news shows and websites. The exposure and visibility of these events offer excellent opportunities for sponsorships. The Harvard Crocodillos is Harvard University's oldest and most prestigious a cappella singing group. Founded at the Hasty Pudding Club in 1946, the group performs popular music from the 1920s through the 1960s across the United States and around the world. These 12 tuxedo-clad undergraduates sing jazz, swing, ballads, and rock from America's Golden Age in over 200 concerts each year. The Crocodillos have spread their musical goodwill to over 100 countries and have recorded over 30 albums. The historic home of the pudding since 1888 is Farkas Hall, which was entirely renovated between 2007 and 2009 and is now one of the premier performing arts venues at Harvard. In the past several years, the Hasty Pudding Capitals has raised over $80,000 so that Cambridge public school children can come see such entertaining and educational performances as the one you saw today. <laughs> Providing support to performing arts-oriented educational and theatrical organizations is at the heart of this institute. The Hasty Pudding Institute of 1770 
is a philanthropic organization whose mission is to promote freedom of expression in all aspects of the performing arts, to encourage satire, comedy, and the cultivation of young talent, not just at Harvard, but also around the world. For example, The Pudding provides grants to support art education in the Cambridge Public School System, the Page to Stage program at the West End House Boys and Girls Club, and has a fellowship program with the American Repertory Theatre. The Order of the Golden Sphinx is the highest honor bestowed by the Institute and recognizes individuals in the entertainment industry for their extraordinary contributions to the performing arts. The award is given at the annual Order of the Golden Sphinx Gala in New York City. In 2013, the pudding celebrated industry leader Michael Linton, the CEO of Sony Entertainment. Join us in supporting arts and artists that otherwise wouldn't have a voice.